Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So this is actually gonna be the first video that I'm posting in 2022. It has been a nice little break, but I am officially back and ready to start kicking out videos. Today's video is going to be things that I've been loving so far in 2022. And I'm really happy to share them with you guys because I know some of them can be really helpful for you guys. And of course, everything will be linked in my description box below. Before we jump any further into this video, do not forget to click the subscribe button it really really helps me out as well as clicking the bell icon so you guys can be notified when i post new videos i'll give you guys like two seconds to do that Okay, so moving on. I'm gonna start this video with things that I've been loving for the office slash electronics. And the first thing that I'm gonna be mentioning is going to be this coach book here. I'm actually gonna be using it throughout this video because I've listed all the things that I wanna mention and it keeps me basically on track on what I should be talking about. It is this coach notebook, which I picked up on the coach outlet. And it's just the book where I include like all of my plans for the next week, what I plan to do for YouTube. And this book keeps me just, like I said, on track. The next thing for the office that I've been loving is this colored keyboard. So I've been hooked. I've seen this all over YouTube and it's kind of like these ASMR videos where people are just exactly just doing that typing type of sound and i actually fell for it i love it so i had to pick myself up one of these old um, typewriter type of keyboards and i've been loving it so far this one was in like a brown type of nude but they have multiple colors online which are like white purple and you can get them in whatever color you want i think it's a really cute addition to my home office since i'm basically working full time from home now so it's been a really really great addition so guys before we actually move on i just want to give you a little snippet of how the keyboard sounds. The next thing for the office that I've been loving is this table wrangler, you could say, and I got it from Amazon. It looks like this. It's in this really nice gray woven type of look. I absolutely love it. There is a magnet here and I just put it on my desk and I just attach the loose cords on my table and I put it on top and it just keeps it there via magnets. And it kind of helps me just wrangle up all the loose cables on my desk because it is a absolute mess. So on the topic of organization, in my office and I'm always looking for ways to clean up my desk so I have the cable wrangler and as well I found on Aliexpress this kind of like shelf that you can put on your desk and so I bought this very inexpensive shelf and I've taken all the stuff underneath my computer and so I have the shelf to kind of separate and make two levels and I really find that this has cleaned up my desk a little bit more and then on top of that I have the cable wrangler so it just all looks a lot more clean so this next item is actually a gift from my little sister I got it as a birthday gift and so far it has just turned up the level of content that I can provide for you guys so I was able to get this Yeti mic it has already already helped me so much with voiceovers. You guys will see that in future videos, as well as you can use them in meetings, for interviews, as well as podcasts. And it folds down like this, but you are supposed to, you know, put it up like that. And it's just sitting on my desk, just like this when I want to record a video. So I really, really love this. Like I mentioned, it has just amplified the quality of content that I can produce. And it just feels really like quality. It kind of feels like I'm having a Grammy, like I just want a Grammy. So on to some kind of camera equipment. It's not really equipment, but it is a camera bag. So if you've seen from two of my vlogs ago, I did get a camera backpack from Brevity and I absolutely love that backpack, but I use it more so for traveling, like if I'm going to New York or if I'm traveling to, I don't know, an island or something on vacation, then I would use that backpack. But for my everyday use, I like to use this camera bag because it's easy for me to take to locations for shoots. And this I got from Etsy and it came with separators and it's well padded and I absolutely love it and it just looks so vintage. It fits my whole aesthetic and yeah, I just absolutely love it. 
So the last thing that I wanna mention in the category of electronics is going to be my Polaroid camera. This is also something recent, but I have been using it so much just to take snippets of moments and it just comes out a little bit more antique in a Polaroid form. So this is the Instax Mini 11. And as you can see on the side, there's also this little bag thingy here. And I picked this up from AliExpress because it came to my mind if I'm gonna be out traveling or whatever and taking Polaroid pictures, where am I gonna put those films after I've taken it? Because you know it prints on the spot. And so I just found this randomly on AliExpress and you basically can put the film inside here when you've taken it and I thought that was just such a great idea because why would I want to take a nice picture and then crumple it up in my handbag after? Really happy about that. So moving on to the topic of like clothing and shoes, I wanted to start off with a new coat that I picked up and I actually picked it up from Hollister. Hollister has some really good finds, you just have to look. So I picked up this coat in a size small. I'll try to find it online for you guys. It's not the thickest, thickest jacket, but you can definitely wear this in the winter. It's not super thin either. And yeah, I just love it. I think it just looks looks really really classy and classic. It's just a great addition into my closet. So the next thing that I want to mention is going to be my Celine luggage. I have done a video already on this. I will be linking it somewhere at the top but I purchased this about two months ago and I am in love. It is my everyday bag. I never thought that I could ever downsize to this size and wear it every day but I've been loving it and I better be loving it because it was an expensive bag. Following my Celine bag like I mentioned it is a smaller bag I did pick up this coach phone bag you could say and this is how I carry my phone now I don't put it in my handbag because I think it's making it just too bulgy and like I said it is a small bag so I prefer to keep it in this little phone bag and then I just I put this bag on first and then I put my jacket on and then I put on the Celine bag and it's like you don't even see this anyways and I like that it's easy access to take out my phone so moving Moving on to shoes, I've been wanting some of these nude boots. I think it just looks so, so trendy and I've seen it all over. And finally, I was able to pick up a pair. They're these chunky, chunky boots. Love, love, love these. The second pair of shoes that I wanna show you guys are from New Balance. They are these 990V five i think that's what they're called they look like this and i got them in the gray color and they are supposed to be just like dad shoes but they are back in trend and i've been loving them i did already style them here i'll put a picture on the screen so the last thing that i want to mention is going to be this laptop holder i picked this up from amazon and it's in this transparent acrylic material i think it's very very chic as well as it's very handy to have sven has been using it almost every single day since I bought it. It's very aesthetic to look at as well as it just looks like nothing's there. This is the laptop holder. Again, you can pick this up from Amazon. You can leave it on your lap and put something here. You can also use it for a book. So I really, really love this. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, I'll be linking everything in my description box, so be sure to check the links down there. It feels so, so good to be back on YouTube to be talking to you guys. In the comment section below, let me know know what you guys have been up to so far this year. I mean, it's been a minute. Yeah, I hope you guys have been staying healthy and safe and I'll see you in the next video.